Hello, this is Evangelist Dr. Robert L. McKim Sr. from Carrollton, Ohio. Well, let, let me tell you something. I've got a couple emails from uh, that Clyde Cash character, or AKA Christian Chandler, or I should say Christian Chandler, AKA Clyde Cash. Because he's constantly giving himself away. He's constantly giving himself away in these emails. And he's lying too. He's a liar. He's a thief. You know, he's been trying to basically steal my identity. Making, and, and making, uh, he's accuser of the brethren. Because he's constantly accusing me of things that I'm not doing on his website to try to defame me and Christianity and God. You know, there's a special hell waiting for him. He asked me, why do you hate me? You know, like I said in my other video I just posted a little while ago. You know what? I love you, but I hate your sin. I hate what you're doing. Love the sinner, hate the sin. That is what we are commanded to do. And that is what I am doing. Hating evil and hating the sin. Your sin. You are sinning, you, and you refuse to turn away from your sins. Midnight, don't get on the papers. Stay off of the papers until I get a bookshelf to put there. My cat wants to, she wants to be right in the sun and have <laughs> sun right on her. And I got papers up here on the stand and Looking for a bookshelf to put there instead. But long story short, what I was trying to say was Christian Chandler, aka Clyde Cash, stated, well, Clyde Cash, this is from, uh, where it goes, Christian Chandler, and then Clyde Cash. And Christian Chandler says, um, basically, he won't give me back my, uh, Facebook site because he thinks I'm a false prophet. And then Christian and then Clay Case says that uh, he reported uh, the Office 2010 as a stolen, pirated copy of Office. Does this look like a pirated copy of Office? No, it's not. Renee bought this when she was going to college with her college uh, money that she was getting. So, you know, these Christian Chandler or AKA Tom Girl or AKA whatever he thinks he is. And then also Clyde Cash or Christian Chandler. I mean, come on now. They, you know, they think they're so smart, but they're, they're so dumb. You might have computer smarts, but you have no common sense. Because your conscience has been seared as like it with a hot iron. You don't have a conscience. You don't have a conscience. And that's the problem with a lot of people in society today. They don't have a conscience. And who, who seared their conscience? Well, for one thing, God seared their conscience. Oh, and somebody had just commented 
on my video. Well, actually, a couple people commented, and these are not, you know, approved comments because I don't have to approve them. You have BBQ sauce on your face. What is, what's your stance on abortion? Well, for one thing, I don't have barbecue sauce on my face. I have a skin problem, okay? I have a problem with my skin on my face. Where my face is red and it gets flaky. So stop with the stupid, rude comments. Because it just goes to show what kind of people you really are. Stupid. And you don't care about people with disabilities. And as far as my stance on abortion, I believe that life begins at conception. And that women should not get an abortion unless it is medically necessary. Either just to save the baby, if there's something going on where they need to take the baby sooner, or <clears throat> to save the mother's life. Because if I if I had a wife, you know, if Renee was pregnant and something was wrong, and the baby was killing her, or you know something happened and it, the the a better chance to save her than the baby, or both, I mean, better chance to save her than both of them. You know, I'd rather have her in my life than the baby. And you know how hard it is to find another woman, especially in these times? So, in my stance is life begins at conception and abortion is murder, unless it is medically necessary. And uh, someone had uh, told me about, uh, oh yeah, this see this one video here that I did, actually I did a couple videos, where I'm holding my Bible. I'm holding my Bible up and I'm telling people about the Bible. What is in God's Word. And just to show how these people are, or how uh, Christian Chandler, a.k.a. Kai Kaish, a.k.a. whoever, whatever he thinks he is, he's made three different uh, other videos of instead of holding the Bible holding a comic book or the Quran or some uh, other uh, you know paper he also has made uh, Renee's uh, stepdad as 007. I wonder if he he's happy about that. He's probably laughing, but uh, I don't think he'd be happy that his uh, picture is on a website for everybody to see. Hey, I'm not the one. I'm not the one doing all this. You are. Christian Chandler, you are Clyde Cash, you are, you are, you are. Got it? Huh? You got it? Hmm? I'm on hold with Microsoft trying to get this product key to work again. So that's the music that's playing. There's a weight music. On hold music. So I'm just gonna go out here and post this video, and uh, you know, then I'll do another video when they answer. God bless you. Have a blessed day.